Hello everyone, uh, welcome back to Lost to Stand with uh, Workers and Resources, Soviet Republic. Yeah, so we've got ourselves finally a viable construction industry going, uh, so we can build stuff. Uh, note that, uh, uh, let's just check in on the, uh, on the money situation here. Note that we're exporting stuff. Uh, what are we exporting? We're exporting fuel for a fair penny and bitumen for less. Okay, uh, we have unemployment being too high. Yeah, so we obviously need to do something. Uh, where is the unemployment too high? Here. Um, okay, how's our... We are draining our input there. Okay. Um, how is our... Uh, supply here. We're building up a bitumen supply there. Yeah. Uh, we're building up a concrete supply here, which is taking a while. Uh, okay. Yep. Good. Right. Good. Yep. Uh, okay. So uh, we're, we're, we, so we basically got a pretty good, pretty healthy income. So we don't need to do local construction specifically uh, just because uh, of cash flow, but it certainly helps. Uh, and it'll help when we start building really expensive things. But uh, right now, uh, at the end of last time, uh, we basically uh, we got this fire station up and it doesn't have a power supply and the temperature's too low. Uh, so what we're going to do is uh, something clever. Oh, something clever, huh? Yeah, uh, is... Uh, uh, what we're going to do is uh, install a heat exchanger. Uh, yeah, that is absolutely brilliant, isn't it? Yeah, so if we stick a heat exchanger, uh, say, here, uh, that, uh, well, why don't we stick it, say, here? Yeah, yeah, if we stick it here, um, uh, bam. Yes. Okay. And then that should get constructed. Now we need to run a heating pipe across. So we're going to grab a heating pipe underground big. Let's look underground. Um, so uh, what we can do is, uh, oh, we've got three heat exchangers already on this one. Yeah, okay. Uh, maybe not so much then. Uh, yeah. Um, yeah, that would overtax it. So we're going to actually get rid of that. Uh, and then we're going to actually do something else. We're going to... Uh, we're going to construct a heating plant instead. Um, uh, which we can uh, stick uh, here, I guess. Yeah. Uh, actually, what we should do is get rid of that. Yeah. Then we can stick a, a heating plant over here. And that's going to do the heating without a uh, heat exchanger. So, uh, bam. Neat flat area. Really? Okay, well, what we can do is, uh, no, oh, I see, it was too steep. Okay. Well, uh, we've got Bulldozer Central, so, uh, Dozer Central, so we can, we can blithely flatten terrain to, until we have plenty of space to put our uh, stuff in. Uh, right. That should be enough. Uh, we'll uh, grab the heating plant again. And we'll bash it in there. Okay. Uh, that should, uh, that should do that. Good. Um, right. Heating plant needs, needs workers. Um, 
uh, will we be able to get where's our uh, oh we're gonna need to uh, go in here and uh, run one of these things out here yeah uh, okay we'll let that build as well uh, bus stop yeah it's got to actually finish building first right now if we uh, if we check in here uh, no when we check in here we've got uh, we got unfinished road Uh, oh, because that has to be set to construct or it's not going to uh, to build it, right? Oh, I did I press the wrong thing? Nope, it, uh, it's noticed it. So it's going to actually uh, go ahead and build it. Okay, so that, uh, that'll get the heat thing over here sorted out for, uh, for this. Right? And the building is going to be without a power supply. So, um, what we want to do is uh, we have a yes, high voltage switch. So, what we want to do is get uh, another uh, high voltage switch over here. Yeah. Uh, okay. So, we go back over here. Uh, high voltage switch which we can put in this way I believe no we'll put it this way uh, just like this I think yeah okay now uh, can we get building in the way Uh, yeah, we're going to have to come down this way, and then this way, and then this way. Yeah, so we will build that. And then we need a one of these. Um, I think we should put that here. Yeah. Bam. Yeah. Uh, so we'll need to... Uh, wait, what, what can this... Uh, no, wait. Um, eight megawatts is probably fine. Put that there. Build it. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so we're so far so good, and then we're going to need a substation, right? Nope. A uh, substation, uh, which we can stick right about... Uh, here, I think. Yeah, we can stick one there. Yep. And then that's going to need... Oh, well, we can just do... This. No. Do this. Yep. Build that. Okay. So we're going to build a bunch of things. And that should sort out a bunch of other things. Uh, right. Okay. So that'll sort out the power over there and get us a uh, connection point to uh, extend the power network uh, as uh, needed. Uh, otherwise known as a power grid, right? Uh, now, of course, we've got plenty of income where I could just, uh, you know, pay to build this, right? But... Uh, Oh, right. Uh, something I want to do. Uh, I want to add that to the uh, fuel distribution network. 
Now you definitely you need the power supply for the uh, fuel fueling station part to work. I think the uh, firefighting works without the power supply, but the uh, the fueling up uh, feature uh, I'm pretty sure doesn't. Right. Okay. Well, we are in fact building things. So that's going to tick along for a bit. Uh, and then we got these uh, uh, bits that are uh, are uh, working their way through the uh, the process here. Um, right. Okay. So we've got a power line that was uh, finished there. Um, right. We've got uh, we're working on the transformer. We're working on the heating plant. The uh, voltage high voltage switch is operating. Uh, we have a traffic jam here because we don't have power yet. Uh, yeah, so the fueling station needs the uh, the uh, the power thing heating problem. Uh, yeah, we know that. Uh, okay, uh, good. We have this. We have that. You know what? Just get rid of that stuff. Okay. Uh, we're a third of the way done the heating plant. We'll have to uh, uh, install uh, a coal delivery there as well. Uh, that's easy enough, of course. Um, we are working on the rest of the constructions here now. Uh, things are making uh, progress, so uh, eventually things will uh, finish. Right. Okay, so uh, I'm going to need... Uh, what am I doing for, for the... Uh, what am I using for... We're buying coal, aren't we? Uh, we are. Okay. Uh, I should set up a coal import operation to uh, uh, to sort all this stuff out, actually. Uh, but yeah, we'll just start out with buying coal. Um, do I have a... Uh, no, I don't have a, a coal import line. Okay. Well, uh, in that case, uh, I'll just import the coal. Um, but I, th it would make more sense to import coal to an aggregate store and then distribute it, wouldn't it? It might. It would make even more sense to uh, uh, to build a coal mine. Yeah, it might. Uh, it, it occurs to me, though, that we might want to get railroads operational. Uh, and importing coal by rail would be more efficient, I would think. Yeah, uh, perhaps that's the uh, thing we'll uh, look into doing. Uh, so that means uh, we'll be importing from Soviet chums, right? And we'll need to put a uh, uh, oh, okay, yeah. We'll want a uh, want it to go through here. Okay. Well, we can start laying out tracks while we're waiting for stuff to happen. We'll use the uh, concrete-based railway. 
Uh, and it occurs to me that we can bring it down around this way. Now we bring it around over here and we can use uh, an aggregate operation up here to uh, handle the coal imports, right? Uh, so uh, we can come around uh, kind of like this, I suppose. Uh, and then across here, yeah, we'll come across to there. And then we need to get through here somehow. Uh, no, we're, no, I think we're better off to go around. Yeah, I think we're better to go around. So we go around. Not like that. Uh, okay. Now, as, uh, as long as I don't actually click to build this... Uh, you know, it's, it, it can sit here as a blueprint forever. Uh, okay, so we come around, we come up, uh, we come up here, and then we can go through, we can go through here, I think. Yeah, we can, okay. And then we can come up this way. Okay. So, uh, what we're going to want is a uh, aggregate store. So, we'll go over here. Uh, gravel, coal, iron. Uh, large aggregate storage. Uh, which will go like this. Uh, we'll stick it right about here. Yeah. Okay, we have flattened some stuff. Yep. And we're going to need a... Uh, um, over here, right? It's a conveyor engine. Uh, which will... Uh, yeah, do that, okay, uh, so, so, yeah, so we have that, yeah, uh, we're going to need a train aggregate unloading, uh, which is not going to need a uh, thing, but we'll space it enough that we have room. Good. And then uh, we need to uh, run a rail up into there. Not that way we don't. Uh, okay, and then the rail would come up the rail would come up like that. Good. Okay, so that would get us a train line that's all nice and convoluted. Uh, because who doesn't like convoluted train lines, right? Uh, I mean, that's the perfect way of doing things, isn't it? Convoluted. Uh, now, we're going to need a... Uh, well, we're going to need to go over here. We're going to need a rail construction office. Uh, which is going to need to be somewhere. Uh and this is going to need all sorts of supplies. So perhaps we should put it up here uh, where maybe we can get some of these supplies. Yeah, the gravel at least. So if we put it up here, yeah, we can put it up here. So we can get the gravel at least uh, from so if we do that, uh, we can go over here. Can we get this into there? Some other infrastructure is in the way. Uh, because of course it is. 
And that's because we're going downhill. Uh, okay, get rid of that. Uh, yeah. Okay, so a little bit of uh, light terraforming. Whoops. Keep pressing the wrong button, right? So the idea is we'll put our, our train office here and then we'll uh, we'll end up with a uh, situation um, yeah because it's uh, winter uh, right but I'm pretty sure if we get this up at the same level uh, we should be able to get the uh, the a conveyor to go over the road and then uh, we won't need to bring in at least uh, we won't need to truck in gravel at least uh, we will need to bring in other stuff by uh, by truck uh, prefabs uh, bricks boards and steel uh, and also fuel uh, but we'll just add that to the fuel distributors business, right? Uh, okay, so now uh, we go uh, construction, uh, rail. Aha! Yeah, that will, that will in fact work. Okay. Bam. Okay. Right. Then we will need a road cargo station, I think. Uh, right, road cargo. Okay. Uh, well, no, uh, we'll put it over here. No, we'll, uh, we'll put it like this. Need flat terrain, left mouse button. Nope. Okay. Uh, we'll do it this way then, of course. Right. So. Okay, so the road cargo station is just so we can do a... Uh, Wait, we could do uh do do this with the distribution office too. Yeah, but uh, a few dedicated. Hmm. That is a a question, isn't it? No, a couple dedicated lines will probably work better. Uh, okay. So, uh, we need a road cargo station. Uh, yeah. So if we do it that way. Yep. Okay. Uh, and then we're going to need a road that comes in roughly like this. Yeah. Roughly up like that. And roughly like that. Okay. Uh, build that. And we're going to need that. Build that. Okay. We have a heating plant. We are going to purchase resources. We're going to auto purchase. Uh, we'll do that. We have no workers. Because it's too far from the thing, isn't it? It's too far from the thing. Uh, okay, is can we cheese it? Um, 
Well, if we did this and this. And then this. Um, and then this. Maybe. Let's just build that and then we'll see. Okay, that that uh, that makes it work. Good, okay. Right. We're good there. Uh, right. Okay, so far so good there. Um, right. Uh, what... We're obviously going to need to get uh, the rail to uh, get from the uh, thing there. The thing there. Uh, yeah, the thing there. So we're obviously going to have to build some sort of... Uh, Um, too steep of a descent. Right. Uh, level terrain. Right. So, uh, we're obviously going to have to get the, uh, the rail business over here. Right, uh, and that will uh, ultimately allow for uh, getting some uh, uh, construction going. So we're going to come out this way. Uh, we're going to do that, uh, that. Right. So we come up this way. Uh, no, we need to come around that way and come around this way. No. No, is that even what we want to do? Hmm. Yeah, so we do that. So that's, uh, that should allow us to get to every point on the track. Uh, it's overkill, I'm sure. Uh, we're not going to flag it for building yet. I turn off the uh, topographic stuff. Uh, look in here. Uh, traffic jam, heating problem, no v yeah, da, 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 da. Uh, get rid of that. Good. Okay. Now, where are we? Uh, where are we at here? Uh, we have half of the bitumen there. We have 173 tons of uh, cement. Yeah. Uh, okay. Uh, we are building roads over there. Which is good. Oh, right. We also need to get roads out this way. Uh, which means we need to uh, do something like this. At least if we want to build that stuff ever. Uh, right. Okay, and then this can come here. Yeah. Uh, like that. Build it. Okay. That gets... Uh, that gets roads to all of those construction points. And then that stuff can construct it, itself in the background as, uh, as time passes, right? Now, let's uh, take a look in here. Uh, we have... 
way too many workers waiting there. Um, and we have, yeah, are we, we're understaffing here, right? Why don't we just max that out? That'll soak up a few. Yeah. Um, okay. So we are definitely doing okay here. Like we're almost up to a million rubles. And we've just, the past few episodes, we've been messing around with uh, spending quite a bit, right? Anyway, uh, we're going to need a new project for the next uh, next episode. Uh, I'm not sure what that's going to be. Uh, I think we probably want to get, we want to ramp this up more. But that means we need more uh, crude oil, right? So uh, let's just uh, check in here and see if we can find more oil. We have more oil over there, which we're already exploiting. Uh, we have oil. How much of that can we actually exploit? Uh, right. So we'll go over here to the oil pump jack. Forty, sixty, seventy. We can exploit a fair bit of it by building right on the border. Oh, that's uh, ah. Okay, so if we did that, uh. We could grab more here. Uh, we could grab more here. Uh, probably be worth grabbing that, and that, and that, even that, that for sure. Well, we could certainly grab some oil from there. Uh, that'd be easy enough to bring up as well. Uh, yeah. Well, that is definitely a spot to exploit. Uh, yeah. And we just need to bring it up uh, into the oil tank here uh, to feed it in. And doing that's relatively easy. So uh, we just we'll just need a power line coming down here, and then we can uh, uh, set all this up. Now, what will we need down here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, so we need three pumps. One, two, three, and then those three pumps would feed into a single pipeline which would bring it all the way up here into this tank, which will, which almost certainly has a spare input. So yeah, we could do that. That would definitely work. And then uh, if we can get uh, even more output here, if we can really max out the refinery, then we can actually use... Uh, If we can max out the refinery and max out and and even exceed the uh, crude oil production, uh, it looks like we can also run an oil powered uh, power plant, which would be something, uh, maybe. Uh, meanwhile, we're actually uh, we're drawing down our input supply, so we definitely need to improve the input supply. Um, yeah, how's the uh, output with the fuel here? 
yeah, we've uh, we definitely need to improve our uh, our inputs. Yeah. Now over here, how's this doing? Um, we're still uh, filling that up. Okay. How's this doing? 178. Okay. I think we're still filling that in. Okay. Well, I think we've uh, basically come to the end of the actual doing things part of, uh, of this episode. So uh, let's just check in on the economy. So if we look at uh, last month, uh, we exported 122,000 and we only imported 30, 31,000, right? So if we look here, we exported 80,000 in fuel and 40,000 in bitumen, right? So uh, that's giving us 120,000 there. And as far as the imports go, uh, we imported power. Now that's going to be our, our, one of our biggest saving when we can start doing that. Uh, making steel, uh, we're a long way away from doing anything about that. Uh, and food is uh, quite a uh, complicated process to sort out as well. Uh, it takes a lot of investment. Uh, coal, uh, it's not that big. Cement isn't going to be that that much of an expense or gravel. So, uh, and the imports on gravel will be from construction. So uh, we uh, will have our best uh, initial gain uh, if we can be self-sufficient for power. And that's going to require coal mining, uh, I'm pretty sure. So, yeah. Uh, so, so there's that. Uh, so we're doing pretty good there. Uh, note also, no loans, right? So uh, I think at some point we might want to start exporting something to the uh, uh, capitalist uh, NATO people. But uh, we're doing okay for now. Uh, it's 1962 and we're we're uh, quite profitable as an oil producing republic uh, and yeah we've got this whole operation here uh, we're slowly uh, constructing all of this business here and once it's all up uh, we can start getting uh, getting some stuff uh, going here uh, and I think importing coal and maybe running a coal power plant up here might not be the worst idea or a coal power plant down here uh it might not be the worst idea huh, we'll see anyway that's going to be all for this episode so uh, i guess uh you know you can do the like comment subscribe business uh, maybe even dislike uh you know if you want uh there's also uh, the bell thing which may or may not give you some useful notifications um but otherwise uh see you back next time